Fuck! What's this say? Welcome to Colton Lake Lodge. We're here to give you the specialised help you need. However, please observe the following. Please ask friends and family to schedule visits beforehand to ensure they don't interfere with your therapy and or periods of creativity. Also, please respect your fellow patients' need for privacy and personal space, especially when they're engaged by the creative processes. Be patient. Typically, our patients have long-term creative problems and they won't be solved overnight. Give yourself permission to take the time you need. Bear in mind that you're voluntarily receiving treatment that has been specifically tailored for you. Engage in therapy trademark and assist the method to flow trademark. Work best when you are actively engaged in shaping them. If you have any concerns, please don't hesitate to voice them. Nice. Well, I guess we have to go find Hartman. Oh. You've knocked over the tables and chairs. Um... Oh, you can actually climb on the tables and stuff. Hello. No. Mullets are funny. Mullets are very funny. Mullet time, wow. Wow. My nightmare is the writers who want to make everything from the characters to the toaster talk, talk, talk all the time and express their feelings. Wow. So they won't shut up. And this guy's very adamant about his uh, gay making. To listen to them because they're not scared of me and everyone should just shut up. Shut up. Shut up. But I don't see <laughs> He's still going. <laughs> Two fills. Wow. Wow, so that's what? Uh, nine. Yes, because taking nine pills really makes you very terrifying. Hello, you're still painting. I thought you were going to go in soon. Can I knock over your painting? No, I don't want to be an asshole. You can go around here, but there's literally nothing here. It's very odd. They should have put something there, but, you know, whatever. Um... How are you guys? Hello. Wait, why don't you humor Dr. Hartman and give the writing a shot, huh? Typewriters in your room. You can get to your room. The doors were stairs. locked. Hartman and the nurses would have keys, but there was no way to get my hands. Okay, I'll go humor Hartman by going and writing a lovely story, shall I? Something's wrong. Oh. I'm not myself. It's hard to think. There's a shadow inside my head. I can only focus on writing. Everything else is a blur. Oh, I'm being creepy at the camera. <laughs> no, she isn't human. You're very right. Truth is coming out. Well, let's go in my room then and give a Brian a shot. Hey, Shay, Shay, hey, Shay, hey, hey. The glare of the blank page in front of me hurt my eyes. My hands began to shake. Maybe it's the lamplight. Because that lamplight is very bright. See what's up. You just keep doing what you're doing. Be cool, okay? On the night of a world of fear. Chaos was all about, but it could be my only chance of getting out of here. Where the hell did he get a from the Wow. Okay, I'm gonna put the 
contact his hand on Barry's shoulder. Hopefully I didn't ruin the flow of that. Sorry, I was going to say I'm going to put the uh, rubbish in here so I may have made some noise, but it ended up, me saying that ended up making more noise than me putting the rubbish in. Sorry, I don't know what I'm on about, but yeah. Oh, you've knocked her out. Wow, what an asshole, Alan. Oh, I knocked the hammer into the ground. I think I'm out there, so I'm pretty safe now that the hammer's like in the ground. Has everyone gone to bed now? Yeah, Mr. Painting's gone to bed. Cool. Well, let's let them uh, deal with him and we'll go out this way. He's not really hiding, he's kind of just locked himself in a room. Hey, these are the guy's paintings. Oh, Alice Wake. Nice. Sounds like me, when I try to write. Exactly, the phone call that we had the end, or towards the end of the last chapter, or in the middle of the chapter, I can't remember, but the episode, um, anyway, that there was cut, cut up to that. Rudolph Lane's case is interesting. He Rudolph Lane? He's the painter, I'm guessing. However, once Wake arrived and started writing, something changed in Rudolph. He's producing extraordinary work, increasingly dark pieces. Unfortunately, he doesn't mm. respond to direction at all. And it's my belief that he's not so much a creator as an illustrator, perhaps, a recorder of sorts. I hadn't considered the existence of such a role before, let alone its implications, but the paintings he has produced are informative. At least he's easily controlled and useful. I wish I could say the same about Wake. Mm -hmm. It's frustrating that the best subjects are always so damn difficult to deal with. <laughs> Alan is damn difficult to deal with. Yeah, I can get a warrant. How are your fragile little patients like that? <laughs> oh, I'm thoroughly intimidated by your mighty authority now, Agent. Listen, you smug snot. How would you like it if I busted through this gate and knocked you around? It sounds drunk, Jesus. Agent Nightingale, first of all, I'm recording this conversation, so you might want to watch what you say. Secondly, you're not. 
not dealing with a hit now. I know the law, and if you can get a judge to grant a warrant, I'll be glad to cooperate. But you won't get one. Be advised that any further communications with me are to be made through my lawyer. I don't believe this. Good day, Agent. <laughs> yeah. 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 Um, sorry, we'll read the manuscript page now. Hartman wasn't happy. Mott could see it in his eyes. He quickly lowered his own. He had made a mess of it, and he knew it. The shame of failure was hard to bear. He hadn't expected Wake to say he needed more time. And he blurted out two days. Less than Wake had asked for to show him who was in charge. But that wasn't part of Hartman's plan. Mmm. And as you can see here that I just noticed, look, it's got the nurse, it's got the, the bird, it's got the meal, and it's got Mott right in front and centre here. The photo on the wall caught my attention. In it, the clinic staff was standing outside the lodge. I knew the man next to Hartman. He was the kidnapper. Hartman had been playing me all along. Well, it's a bit old after you go in there and do all that and then find this, but you know, that's all right. Oh, God. Barry? Barry? Why have you got the other wakes? <laughs> that always makes me laugh. I walked in to see the stand We need to get to Hartman's office. It's right next door. You okay? Yeah. I mean, no. The cops found me a Rose's trailer, but they didn't hassle me too much. I'm obviously a victim in this, and I demanded to be treated as such, or else I'd sue their asses. Speaking of asses, that bed gave me a real hard mm, time. I'm sure I would have. Where you were. That guy's crazy now. But he let me go, and then I get a call from Hartman, that son of a bitch, who tells me you're here, and I should come pick you up. But when I got here, two goons clobbered me and stuck me in there. What's... what's with the cutout? Yeah, that's my that's question. Every time I see it. Piss off Rose after what she did to us. That'll teach her. Yeah, that's a harsh punishment. Come on, pal, we gotta get going. The standee, it always just makes me like uh, smile with delight at how stupid it is just for him to have brought the standee with him. These were all the pages I had on me. And more. Alan, please. You're sliding back into the Tell me one more lie and I'll shoot you in the face. That's not. Is that aimed in his face, oh, Alan? Well, never the shot. Really, Wake. Come on, let's work together on this. You have no idea. Hartman, shut up. Barry, get out of here. I'll catch up with you. Get a car. Oh, Al, let's just go. Wake, mm. listen to me. This is a mistake. Don't you see? Together we can create something absolutely wonderful with your ability and mine. Oh dear. That was a good bookcase. Whoa. Love how I made the uh, door card open noise that you hear in the game. <laughs> that was amazing. Look at him smile coyly. Well done, Alan. Oh dear, that's a bit shaky. Sorry, the spot was easy to see in the dark even with all the extra lights in the boat. Why even with? Like, why even? If there's lots of extra lights in the boat, surely you'd be able to see it. Even implies that, you know, it would be hard to see with the extra lights. So I, that's a bit of an odd word in there. Um, sorry, I just thought I'd point out that the English nerd of me went, ah, this doesn't sound amazingly right. Oh dear, Hartman's office is now just a dark blob of darkness. Um, I better... Oh, what are you doing, Alan? Alan? Oh, yeah, this one we... Okay, this, that, that, that's my problem. This one you have to hold down E, but there's no indication that you're supposed to hold down E. Um, so it's just a bit odd <laughs> to me. Like, it doesn't make that much sense. 
Um, oh, Poltica Wisps, fantastic. This is the new outro song. I'm saying goodbye because the video has ended. Da, 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 da. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And come back and watch some more as they come online.